So the latest news distraction, whatever, is this quarter where George Washington is a little bit more chiseled and he's turning his back away from God and in other words, in God we trust. So what does the quarter really mean? I have an idea. Let's look at the back of it. They're always messing with our money. In 2020, they did this. So it's nothing new under the sun, but let's look at the back of the brand new quarter. And we have, sorry, trying to help focus. We have an astronaut and her name is Dr. Sally Ride. So let's investigate and see who she is. Um, I have nothing to say. She is a NASA employee on the back of our quarter. So what did she do? She must have done something really important. Why haven't I ever heard of her? Let's see. She was the first American woman to fly in space. For fun, she liked to run. She also played tennis, volleyball, and softball. Ride wrote science books for children. Does Ride sound like a legit last name? What was Sally Ride's early life like? Sally Ride was born in 1951 in California. After high school, she went to Stanford University in California. She earned a degree in physics. Physics is a type of science. That's for all of you gullible people that don't know that are reading this. How did Sally Ride become an astronaut? NASA began looking for women astronauts in 1977. Sally Ride was a student at the time. She saw an ad in the school newspaper inviting women to apply to the astronaut program. Sally Ride decided to apply for the job. She was one of six women picked, but she gets to be on the quarter. She became the first American woman to fly in space. She was an astronaut on a space shuttle mission. Her job was to work on the robotic arm. She used the arm to help put satellites into space. She flew on the space shuttle again in 1984. Ride stopped working for NASA in 1987. She started teaching at University of California in San Diego. She started looking for ways to help women and girls who wanted to study science and math. She came up with the idea of NASA's EarthCam project. EarthCam lets middle school students take pictures of the Earth using a camera on the International Space Station. Students then study the pictures. In 2003, Ride was added to the Astronaut Hall of Fame. The Astronaut Hall of Fame honors astronauts for their hard work. Until her death on July 23rd, 2012, Ride continued to help students, especially girls, study science and math. She wrote science books and other things. She worked with science programs and like how many times can they say science? So this woman really loved science and she's on the back of the quarter where the president has turned his back to in God we trust. So why don't they just put in science we trust? Because like, do you even care? Do you think money is about God anyway? Like, we don't care what you do with your stupid quarters.